What's going on guys? We've got a new video today. We are checking out the TRX4 on tracks again. This time we're using it with um, an Enjora Cherokee half druggy hard body, which makes no sense because these things are unibody. And we have an actual, we have a, well, it's a Grand Cherokee sitting right there in a nice field of openness. But uh, yeah, we have this today. We have lights and that, all that that works. And the body's held on my magnets and it fell off doing that, so yeah. I need to find a better way of mounting that, but for most part in the snow, that usually doesn't happen. We'll uh, pick her off, throw her back on, and not look at the wiring to keep the lights running because that's an abomination nobody ever wants to see. And we got this nice blizzard where we got some more piles of snow and stuff out here to crawl on, so we'll, we'll try and run some new lines and put the tracks to use today. Phone does not do the climbs of this justice. Like this would not be um, not happening with the wheels. So let's try and let's get a 55 gallon barrel in there for scale at least to see how tall the drifts are. Here. It's been warmer yesterday and today, so the snow's been getting dense. Wait, maybe we can climb this now, so we couldn't before. If we try enough, we might make it. Nah, we're not, we're not going to make that. Move on to trying to climb some, let's try over here maybe? It's less steep. I think we'll make it here. There we go. We can probably come down this now. Success. Try and get a side shot from here so you guys can get an idea of what kind of an angle we're actually working with climbing this right now. We've got to pack our little road in. I think we buried it. Ah, there's our first stuck for the day. I need to walk around because I'm not sure what I'm about to drive this thing into. Eh, we'll try and descend it. Things you can do with tracks. Maximize articulation. I need you guys side angles of this because the camera really doesn't do slopes like this justice. And we made it down, okay. Move on, we got a couple snow piles back there. We can try climbing along with some stuff right here. I think we'll make it up this. I see tracks from where we did this before. Yeah, no problem, right up it. 
you can climb this now. Anyway, we're, we'll have to make our way down. Watch our angles with the tracks to try and make a climb work. Right, there we go. All right, new snow pile to play with. We can just walk all over that without even, not even thinking about it. I go up here. Precarious situation. Looks like we have made it. Coming out the back side again. Try and go skiing down the steep slope right here. Try and get you another shot on the side so you can see how steep this is. All right, we'll move on to the next crawling spot and just to our next spot to Mount Doom over here. Looks like the snow has drifted in a little bit more than it was before. I've got a couple ideas for ways I want to try and crawl this. We'll start by trying to come up the side here. What's fun, what I have fun with on these tracks is on, on stuff like this, you can't, you have to just bomb it on tires. You can kind of attempt to slowly crawl more technical stuff in the snow. Making it up. Oh, this is a scary spot to be. Down goes the TRX-4. We'll try that again. Slightly less patient coming up this time. So what I'm trying to do is crawl all the way over the top of this, back down the far side. precarious situation. If I had a better servo in this, that would definitely help with steering through stuff like this. problem I'm having is just burying that front right track, or the front left track, I guess. There we go, we got her out. Success! Alright, we'll move on, we'll try and climb the hill over here now if we can.
we have moved over slightly. Take a run at some of these little sand dunes we've got. Snow is very wet and tacky today. Very dense. Well, soft, sugary, and dense. All of the, every quality that makes the snow not fun, that's what we're dealing with today. And we clawed our way out. That little reverse action is what I found. If it starts to get buried, going back and forth a few times like that seems to help unstick it. All right, this is the last sort of area we've got to play around with today. Haven't attempted to crawl any of this yet, but we'll give it a shot. I'll bust through with the back track there. I'm gonna have to try this from the other side. Make it through the chasm. There we go, no problem. I'll try and do that one more time. You can see if you look at the angle of the tracks, when something's like higher in the front of the track, they just lined up and tend to get stuck. Get one shot coming straight at us from the front. Crawling our way through the chasm. Not quite flipping. Doing good. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that, but yeah, we're about out of time for this video, I think, if anybody's uh, still sticking around. Hopefully you enjoyed that. I mean, the, um, the tracks again on the Enjora Cherokee body this time, so we got something new and some new terrain. Let me know if there's anything you guys would like to see in the future. Thanks for watching.